Hello everyone and welcome to Gilbro's Gaming Channel. I'm the dude and we're about to play Sal Conflict of Nations Saudi Arabia playthrough day 26. Here we go. Super that blah 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 blah. Okay so we've got I've just sent a troop over here I've just sent him to come and join the front. We're gonna see our front line. These guys are gonna come join the front. Uh, we had a look at our we've conquered we've annexed we're looking good. Resources looking absolutely fantastic so I think it's time that we do some um, some conquering over here so you you I'm gonna split these up because what we're gonna do here is we're gonna take these out here so they can potentially oh hello hang on wait whoa yeah Thailand oh, I forgot we don't want to just move straight in do we I mean they're just going for it. It's tempting. It's tempting. Um, yeah, they are going for it. Okay, let's do that then. All right, so we'll split this up as planned. I shall move this here. Yeah. And yes, we shall fight. These men shall go in and uncover thy enemy. And we shall bombard them. Excellent. All our little boaties sitting around. Uh, we have two soldiers here. What we'll do with those is I will leave them behind. We'll go and take this one in between. I need to get some more troops up, up the front here. Now we've got a big stack here. Uh, we need to split this down a little bit. Uh, I think you can have a stack of eight if I'm right. I'm right. I don't know. No, something's still wrong with this. Oh, it's because of the. Um, yeah, hang on. My bad. There we go. And these troops need to make it. What is going? Wait, what's this? Who's that? Something's coming over here. Okay. You go capture that. You guys go capture that. And then we'll move you up to the front as well. And you can get over there. Oh, hang on. We've got all this red to capture as well. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute, you know. Uh -huh. Where have we got you going? Let's get all this under wraps. I think we're going to meet some resistance. That's okay. What we'll do is we'll send these along for the trip. As well. Fantastic. Right, so they'll sort of link up. Our tank and all its crew can just come on in. We shall get the tank to go here. And then we're going to run it down into that city that I'll probably never be able to say the name of. Nakhon Rashasima. And yeah, that's as good as it gets. Okay, I'm going to take five ships around to Bangkok. And then we shall also start bombarding Surat Thani. Excellent. Okay, well that's pretty perfect. Right, now what I want to do. I need some jets, guys. It's depressing me not having strikers. Strikers feel au naturel. And so we shall bring our cities up. Anything with a level two is getting a striker from me. Level two. Can we afford strike? We can afford a few, yeah. Not loads and loads. You're building resources. Perfect. You don't have an airport. 
You don't. You don't. You don't. You do? Level 1. You're getting level 2 very soon. Very soon. Level 1. Level 1. Level 1. Level 1. Level 1. Level 2. Hello. Hello. Okay. We'll start annexing you. Because you're going to be pretty cool. Mm, ready? So, we'll start looking at these level 1s. Start popping them up to level 2. That's going to be quite nice. Alright. That's damaged, so we need to repair that first. Get a level 2. Level 2. What have we got? The resources are still getting eaten away here. Oh well. Um, very good. Okay, next up. Shall we build more soldiers? Yeah. Yeah, we should. I don't really want to get any more boats. I feel like that's alright. Yeah, we probably should get some, some of these. Hmm. But at the same time, I kind of don't want to. How many... Let's have a look at our... Yeah, we've got a few. I could probably run off a few of those. Let's get some of these. These are pretty handy having some artillery going up the front. If we meet a massive amount of resistance, we can just start pelting it from outside. And then if they want to attack us, we'll be the defender. Which is always a bonus when you've got these troops. Lovely, lovely. And now we shall buy infantry. Let's get a massive army. The resources have really come in, haven't they? I mean, I know this is only one part today and probably tomorrow as well. But that's pretty nice. Right, cool. We've got that done then. Uh, we don't have enough resources to really go ham on techno hello. technology. We should probably do something technology-wise. What are we not doing with this? What is North Korea creeping up inside of us here? You guys, you're doing it. Right, okay. Um, I'll send my little men in to go and test the waters. Why not? Oh, man. You might not be coming out of here, lads. But we have backup. Um, yeah, let's have a look. Is there anything on the market? Oh, there is as well. Let's just let's just buy it up because we can. And these are stupidly cheap. I can buy so many. Let's buy let's buy some. And these. I'll I'll buy some of them. Yeah. Wow. That was really good. Someone's quitting the game then. They're selling off all their resources. Potentially Myanmar. Right. Cool. Alright, let's have a look at what the Allies are doing. Oof, Russia is nearly gone. We're going to be making our move over here. We have nearly conquered the world, guys. This is insane. Very insane, you know. South America is the last one standing, yeah? She? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Alright guys, well, I'll leave that one here. We'll be back tomorrow for one part. I'll do that um, late in the evening as well. Hopefully we'll have a bit more progress going on. It's going to be wonderful and we'll, uh, we'll play a bit more then. Thank you very much for watching and uh, I'll see you on day 27. Hello all and welcome to day 27 of our Conflict and Nations Saudi Arabia game. Let's get to our front line. As you can see, we've got a bunch of troops ready to rock and roll. Ooh. Ooh la la. What we got? Myanmar having a little bit of a fight here. Okay. Let's move these troops around. See if we can get them down here. Seven hours time. Is that still moving in? Um, I think we can defend that anyway, that's fine. It's no big deal, but we'll move extra troops into the area. Anyway. Actually, we'll give that a little finisher. Finisher! 
Right, let's uh, move you down into that city. Nice. What is happening in there? No one knows. Alright, let's keep moving. Okay, we've got a whole bunch of stuff to be looking at here. Did I just do all the work for you to take that city? I did, didn't I? Great. That's all good. I don't mind. Um. I'll tell you what, we could take the mechanized. No, actually, no. Leave them there. Leave them there. Excellent. And what we could do is we own this one, so we can build ourselves a nice little airbase here. That'll be handy. Get our troops a lot quicker. Okay, so. Let's move up all our stuff to the front line, which we will call here. We'll get it all there and we'll sort it all out later. Do, 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 do. Yeah. I think the more I play, the more I'm realising what strategies I would like to play. Because um, recon vehicles, you know, I like them quite a bit. It's, an, it's a cheap unit you can get with infantry. I quite like the motorised infantry, especially late game. They get really good, so them with a recon vehicle, they can see what's coming earlier you can always adapt and late game you can actually fire with a, a ranged attack keep you guys safe mix that up with strike fighters then absolutely amazing that one just got made nice let's go get you over there okay is that no you need to go Lovely. Jubbly. Is that everything? I think so. <clears throat> right. Awesome. Things are looking very good. Let's look through all 83 of these. <laughs> oh my. Conquering. Conquering. With Annex Baghdad. That's excellent. Can we repair some stuff please? I don't like seeing it like this. Um, what else we got? Do -da -da. Made all these units. Perfect. Taken, fighting, taken, fighting, taken, fighting, 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 fighting. Right, this didn't go to plan, so you got my ick. But we own it now, so that's alright. That is null and void. Yeah. Alright. I'm pretty content with that. That's fine. We've got these guys sitting up here. Let's move you down. Start taking up some of these lands. What we'll do is we'll send them round. Just to claim up all these random pieces. There we go. They can get that done while... Turkey's armies just go and conquer whatever they want. Um, yeah, Cambodia is going to be taken. Vietnam will be taken. Our boats are in place to do the job. What I need is some of these ones I'm transferring. These infantry. If we find some. Like this dude. What we'll do. Ha. Ha. We will send it round to capture. Well, that's a good one. At least we'll have this city. We can claim the rest of it soon enough. Can't get any closer to that. Well, that one can, though. I'm not too worried. 
Uh, we'll sort out all of this. Take it all the way down. Start taking Indonesia. That'd be nice. Okay, looking at the map. Our allies are doing absolute number on all the lands here. Very nice. Very nice. We're looking excellent. They're just going to claim out some of this land. Good. We've got some random bits of land up here, guys. Right, what are you doing? This is my random collector that I sent off last time. So we're going to send this little random man to go do some random collection. There we go. Just get, get this stuff collected up. Okay, can we get any technologies? First of all, we're going to get that technology because that's super important. And then we'll start getting more of these technologies. Perfect. Let's go into our cities. <coughs> Excuse me. And let's see if we can get any more strike fires, please. Mm -hmm. I can't build that there. Level 2. Can't do this. We need an airbase level 2. That's not finished yet. Alright, gotcha. Now we have up, almost upgraded a bunch, so we're going to be able to build strike fighters real quick afterwards. Which is good. Um, <clears throat> let's get some more infantry. Land troops, bombards, recons, all that shebang. I'm not too worried about getting tanks, it's just so slow. I really like being nimble between airports, which is why artillery, recon vehicles, and infantry, we can just move them around the map so fast. And I feel like that's how I like playing, I think it works for me. It might not work for everyone. But that's okay too. Right. Is there anything for sale? No, of course not. Of course not. <coughs> hmm. Hello. Got another troop sitting there. Tell you what we'll do with you then. As you're the new guy, we're going to send you down to here as well. So there'll be two on there. That'll be good. We'll keep the boats here, just in case whatever this is decides to move south. I can see Turkey have planned a route to this city. They're probably going to try and take it from me. But that's, it doesn't matter. Um, but I'd rather get my points up a little bit. Let's have a look at the points for instance. You see, we're not even top four. We're fifth. I'm not, I don't know what kind of gold you get given out. But we are going to be part of the winning team, which... We should then become top four, right? Um, yeah. Just all about gaining gold for free. We love it. All right, guys. Well, I'll leave that one there. We'll be back for day 28. I think I might be able to get two parts done on tomorrow's. So, hopefully, I shall show you what this is like in the morning and the evening. I'll see you there. Hello all and welcome to Saudi Arabia playthrough of Conflict of Nations day already. Let's have a look at what we got. Ah, we got a load of troops been made. That's it's very nice to see. We're about to take this chunk. Good. Heading towards the front line. Looking pretty dandy. Okay. Oh, we can see we've put the uh, the work. Did I capture this one or? No, they took it. All right. Great. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> Never mind. Moving on. We shall send our boats around to get some of Indonesia. That's no issue. Um, to be honest, we can move these troops just collect up some places who owns this we don't know 
not that. If I get them down to here, then when we come back on day 30, they'll be right on a port. And then you can just go in and go take Medan. And as, as long as Turkey don't get there first, we'll see. Right, let's split this lot up. Uh, we'll leave the National Guard. Perfect. We'll send these down here. And collect up all this land if we can. Nice. Um, we've got a striker jet here actually. What we can do is just go and check that. Just in case there's something in there. Fly them around. Four troops sitting here. Let's send them in. Let's go collect some more land over here. Tell you what, we'll actually just march them straight in. Get you guys to march in there. We'll do a patrol around that area with that striker jet squad. We shall match these. Let's do that this way. There we go. Everyone get in there. You guys, I want you to take that land. Can we leave two there? Just go take that. Um, who is this? China. We're going to be starting the war with China. It looks like they probably already have anyway. So let's waypoint up into there. No problem. We'll get them onto that new front line. That should be lo looking pretty good. Yeah, you guys are busy. Nice. Okay, where else have we got troops? These guys need to come down. Ooh, what's this? China. Nepal. China. Right. So once you're done with that, can you go collect that? Yeah. And that. Get them busy. And all our new troops now need to come to the new front line. Which will be... Alright, let's get them over here. That's our nearest... <laughs> oh man, we've got quite a few. Can I get more than one? I can, if I'm holding down shift. Oh wow, okay. That's more like it. Mm. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Keep hold of shift. Yep, I think we've got them all. We're going to get them to move. We could have done that one, but we'll do this one move to there. So is that all of them? Yep. Perfect. Good stuff. Right. So we'll get these as well. If it'll let me pick them up. Just two jets. Let's bring them in. Um, we'll station them in there. Very nice. Okay, well that looks good. Let's have a look at the events we've got. So, a bunch of mobilization. Borders of that place has been... Was it this? Yeah, okay. Turkey dealt with that for me, I guess. Thank you. We lost a tank battalion in that city. Alright, we softened it up in Turkey. Turkey, I see a, a pattern going on here. Um, yeah, big fight in that one as well. Alright, never mind. That's all good. We'll keep moving forward. Let's get our cities up. There must be some things we want to be doing. We we must be so close to endgame, so... Makes you wonder if it's worth doing any of this, but we will do it anyway. I'm going to get recruitment officers. If we can buy as many of these as possible with whatever resources we have. It'll just speed things up a little bit. We should probably annex 
some more stuff as well. There you go, Alex, that one. Don't know where it is. Jamu, so very somewhere not. I don't know. Um, level two. Can't afford to annex anymore. Just keep getting these level ones and twos on the recruitment officers. It's going to increase our population, or what's that called? Manpower. And then um, it's also going to speed our recruitment up. I shall show you the uh, stats on it. So level one. Oh wait, we got level five. So it's telling us the next two levels. Right. So mobilization speed is 70% more. If we get up to level five, it'll be 100% more. It costs us more to run it. Um, but that doesn't matter. Because it's going to be worth it. You think we're getting 100% speed. Manpower generation. Flat resource bonus which is the manpower that's going to be nice we bust troops out a little bit quicker i'm not going to build any more troops i don't think we've really got any resources for it um if we've got can we get an arms industry in one of them supplies yeah nice okay looking good so our jets are now gonna circle over there any threats they should should destroy it it's a strike wing it's all good we have other jets going down here just to do the same thing here we've got more jets ferrying over so how many's in this squad so they can team up with this one and um yeah i feel like the way i like to do it is with jets infantry and artillery and boats but we'll see going forward if that needs to change we'll have to do it but I think we should be all right as you can see we've nearly conquered the world looking very good are they gone for South America yet they're heading down just one little piece of land up here for North Korea <laughs> right make that trip on there but yeah we can see if we can get down to Australia I'm in no rush to try and take loads of land but if I could that would be a good idea because you want to get on this top top lot for the more gold when you win that's no big deal a win's a win it goes under the belt alright guys well I'll leave that one here we'll get this all happening and I shall be making one or two parts on the next day we'll see what I can get done for you Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you on the next bit. Hello all and welcome to Conflict of Nations Saudi Arabia playthrough. We are on day 29, the official day 29, because I said yesterday was day 29 and that was day 28. And this is part one. Let's have a look at what's gone on then, guys. Oh, hello, we've met some resistance up in here. Oh dear. Um. Hmm. Have we got any strike fighters ready to go? So, something's kicking off up here. Right. Are they helping me with their... They are. Legends. Right, yeah, we've got some strike fighters here. So what we'll do then is we'll send them up to go and support my infantry there. Hang on. Grab them. They really have trouble grabbing some of the planes. Have I got any more? I don't think so. Yeah, to war with Indonesia, let's do it. After that, you go there as well. We shall start taking that over. Beautiful. Um. Hmm. 
Oh yeah, we've got some jets here. I knew we had more. Ah-ha! Can you go and help as well, please? All this scouting is just helping Turkey take all the land. Well, that's fine. We are a team. I don't mind too much. But you know what? I need some land, my friend. I'm just mopping up all this. These little bits. That's odd. Is that quicker? We'll set these to go do a bunch of bits and pieces. There we go. Um, we got some troops here that we could send around to claim some of this. They're not that bothered about claiming... What the heck? The little bits of land, so we'll we'll help them out with that. Yeah. We're gonna get you. We'll just get them to go straight there. They can be a team. Wonderful. All right. So now both sides of the boats are gonna be clearing the cities. Perfect. What is all any now? I'll tell you what. We could actually use this one to go all the way around and claim that city rather than that way I think by the time they get there it should be pretty clear um right yeah looking very nice let's have a look at our events we just done this um what oh yeah they're destroying some of my stuff here that's okay <clears throat> Oh, excuse me. Um, yeah. Bits of fighting. Yeah, that's okay. All good. Things are being made. Lovely. Jubbly. Right. Talking of things being made, any city I own down here, just make sure it's got an airport on it, just so we can get troops here quicker. Should probably start annexing stuff as well. Should we annex? Don't want annex. I feel like this one's more of an annexable city for me. Let's do this one. I don't know why. I just prefer the location of this one to this one. Hmm. Well, our resources are looking pretty good, except supplies are a bit short. Let's see if we can get a supply thing in here. Lovely jubbly. Um, maybe that's not ours. I'm so confused. That's not ours. Can I afford? Nope. Can I buy? Nope. The market has been so dry. It's terrible. What a terrible market situation we have. New Delhi. It's not even mine. Don't worry about that. Um. Yeah, that's already upgrading. Okay, so the supplies are already on their way to greatness. Can we afford to do? No. We are so poor. I was thinking maybe we could get a level 1, but I doubt we could even do a level 1. Damn. Need more for the research. Because we've got two spaces now. Now we've upgraded our infantry here. I need to get that and get them up to here, which would be very nice. And our jets. I'd like to get the next jet. But all you need are a bunch of supplies for all this. So that's why we've got to get the, uh, the resources up there. Did we have any troops made over here? I don't think so. No. No. Nah. Okay, we've got more troops flying in. You know, the amount of troops we have here is pretty good. I feel like that's that's come a long way since we were starting off in the beginning. We've got extra troops here. Um. <clears throat> I want to go get Hanoi. What I'll do is I'm going to get these troops to meet up with meet up with them all right so they're gonna go meet up with these and then we're gonna send those in to go collect Hanoi and we'll start pushing forward there maybe some of these cities here we are so close to, to taking this whole world and it's only day 29 it's amazing I mean look how many troops they got flying in they own most of the world so it's easy for them 
um, but they've done really well. A real good number. Right, we've got some little randoms over here. Let's move them in to go claim some bits and pieces. Um, oh wait, they're sending... Oh no, they're collecting that up. Alright, let's go collect to this one. And this one. <laughs> we're just we're just scrambling around getting little bits and pieces. Let's go get them all. Leave nothing. That one's just kind of annoying, isn't it? Did I not go and send something up there? Apparently not. Alright, um I'm gonna get you to move up there. This is gonna take a long time. But we'll have you meet there. So They'll all end up in the same place if we find them again. Very nice. Very, very nice. Oh, there's a lot of um, this area still to go. We could probably send some troops in over here just to sort of get some land claim. And then we've got the South America to do. And the North is pretty much done. That's amazing. Such a number on it. These guys are great. Yep, where do we sit? We're still sitting on fifth? Yep, that's okay. Our points are like less than half of our teamies, which are just amazing. You know, we're doing all right, but we're definitely not top player. These guys have just been such a solid force. It's, um, it's good to see. It's good to learn little bits and pieces from what people do. Alright guys, well, I'll leave that here and we'll be back for part 2. Hello all, and welcome to day 29, part 2 of our Saudi Arabia campaign on Conflict of Nations. Okay, let's have a look at what we've got going on. Righty, oh. Hmm. This is not good. Is it reduced because of the artillery I believe hmm. um, okay let's get them up there Put them into there. That'd be good. And you guys can go to there. And then uh, join up with this lot here. They will bombard because they'll be there within four hours, five minutes. And they're going to take 14 hours. So it's about 10 hours of bombardment from those artillery. Even though it's a little bit low, we'll take it less efficient okay we've got more troops up here we need to go and move in no don't split let's go get them in the same position and then we need to take all these lands as well perfect Right, and that'll be clearing up that zone nicely. We've got some fighter squadrons here. Wonder if I should send my jets in to go destroy them. Problem is they've got the advantage. Being a fighter squadron is better than being a striker. Hmm. Especially in air combat. Okay. Send those in over there. Send those in over there. Got all these troops. 
How long would that take? 11 hours. Ooh. Go for it. That'll be alright. Um, actually, no. Let's bring you lot down to... Down to her. Not split. Keep doing that. Let's claim all this land. <laughs> Crazy. Right, yep. Yeah, they're going to be bomb. Uh, what? Well, they're going to take that. Let's just face it. They're going to be doing that. Oh, yes. Yes, they will. We'll send these around there to clear the next lot. Perfecto. Right. Now, one thing we wanted to do was get an airbase over here straight away. So we can proceed to take it over as fast as possible. Um, let's build some troops. We've got 46 events, but most of them should be... We'll annex Jammu. It's just going to be war declared against Cambodia. Nepal, all these little bits and pieces that we're just walking through. Vietnam, yeah. Yeah, it's alright. Okay, let's bring up our cities. I need some troops that can go on a plane. Wait, before we do that, let's get upgrades. I never did upgrade these much, did I? Um, I'd rather have that upgrade, do Okay, let's upgrade. Um, pop them out. Did that work? No. Oh, we lost connection or something. Let's give it on. Uh oh. I don't know what's happened. Oh, that did work. It's just slow we can't afford any more anyway okay something's going a bit laggy oh teleported yeah all right never mind let's just make sure we've got everything set up where it needs to be set up they're going all the way up there goodness me we need to uh can we send these up here i'm not sure we'll be able to yeah Go send them to help out so we don't have to send nothing else all that way. They're going there and there. Lovely. Alright. That'll be fine. We should be taking most of this very quickly. Nice. Yeah, I think I'm happy enough with that. Cool. Let's have a look at how the allies are all doing. Look at this. This is ridiculous. I don't understand why the game's still going. It's absolutely insane. Um, yeah, they're going to be making their move on that. That's not going to take long to take South America. Still working on a bit of Canada and Alaska and stuff like that, but um, that won't take long. Looking good. Looking very good. And then you got our scores. I'm still fifth, but these scores are crazy. So is that one to be fair? Shared intelligence. Why have I got shared intelligence? They are part of my team. That's all right then. Oh, freaked out a little bit. What the heck? All right, cool. All right, guys. Well, I'll see you on day 30. Hello, all, and welcome to day 30 of our Saudi Arabia playthrough on Conflict of Nations, part one. All right. We've got 53 notifications. We're going to go move up to our front line. Um, no. Oh, I don't think we managed to save that one up there. Never mind. Okay, let's have a look. We've got some things we would 
like to go and help destroy perhaps let's go take these out with our little jet boys excellent um, they're gonna go take that are we bombarding I don't know I don't think there's nothing to bombard in there so let's move them into the city they're gonna take that and then move in we'll have a lot of troops in this bit it's gonna be quite good um, I'll tell you what maybe we could just march these straight through and just collect up some land yeah let's do that um, okay looking down at Indonesia looking good looking good so they're gonna take that we've got an airport which is not quite ready to accept our jets yet but that'll be when we can take things a lot quicker Let's move uh, this infantry battalion that really needs some help. We'll move that to Indonesia because that's where our new front line will be. And in fact, you guys can move over. Hello. You move here as well, please. That's going to be lovely. Alright, looking good. Um, <clears throat> hello, we've got more troops up here. Let's use uh, these troops to go and take this piece of land here. We'll use these troops to come in. Uh, they can take this piece of land here and then we'll move them onto that. Um, and then, yeah, everything's moved up. Once our airport gets up to 40%, we can use it. But we're at 33% at the moment, so we'll move all the jets down with them as soon as possible. We need to take out these aircraft. Problem is, my aircraft not really going to do the job very well. I mean, we'll probably win, but it'll come at a cost. Let's have a look at this. So we've annexed Yangon. <clears throat> Built a load of recruitment centers. Lovely jubbly. Hello. Beast. Yeah. So we did lose whatever in there. Where are you going? Oh, you're bombing it. Okay. I've got some more jets. Let's move these down. Oh, ferry you down here. Wonderful. Right. I don't really need any more boats. I'm quite happy with the amount of boats we've got. But let's see what we can do jet-wise. I'd like more jets. So it just increases my mobility. Can't do jets with that one. Um, let's get it so it can. Get some airports, man. Mobility, mobility, mobility. I love a bit of mobility. We're looking pretty good. Um, financially, it's okay. Jet. Now we're getting a bit poor on supplies. That's okay. That's okay. It's okay. That's no, not. That's not okay. We can make troops here. Odd. Because it needs other buildings to be able to make troops. Let's get some of them other buildings sorted. Hello. Can we make more jets? Yeah. More jets? Yeah. More? Yeah. How much stuff we got? We're looking good. Go on, we have loads of jets. Yeah. Lovely. Right, um, let's get a recruitment office in there. And that should be pretty good. Okay, we're coming along now, I'll tell you. We're only on day 30. We own all of this random piece of land here. It's not a lot compared to our allies. But 
we've done alright. And our resources are coming in quite nicely now, where we can more or less build what we want when we want it. Okie dokie. Let's bring these troops over here as well. And then eventually I'll see, once all the smoke settles and their troops are out of the way, we'll see what is left here that I'm not looking at. Awesome. Right, zooming out. Let's have a little look at what our allies are doing. They've already taken these little islands over here. Nice. Looks like they're going to be making a move on Japan soon. We're just going to keep pushing through Indonesia, maybe get to Australia. Um while they conquer the rest of it, to be honest with you, because they've got it all wrapped up. Hello, what's going on here? There's a bit of a scuffle still going on here, is there? A scuffle? Peru and Argentina are having a bit of a, a Barney. But that Barney is going to come to an end because my allies are coming. Awesome. All right, guys, well, I'll leave that one here, and we'll see you on part two. Hello all, and welcome to part two of day 30 of Saudi Arabia playthrough on Conflict of Nations. Right, we're going to send this one right over. Ah, why? Get to the front line, sir. Get to the front line. Okay, so we lost something here. Let's have a look. Yeah, we lost that Acer. Okay, well... Let's wait for backup. Sutton here as well. Hello. Interesting. Where's my little boaties? I'll send my boats around to her and they can destroy that for me. Lovely. Lovely, jubbly. Hey. They've pretty much cleared that right, haven't they? Okay. Let's just send one troopio. See if we can go claim this little piece of land here. Let's just see if we can raise them. Aha. Okay, cool. And we're taking this one as well. Very good. Um, did we get that one back here? Yes. No. There's that one. Um, there's a couple of bits and pieces here, there, and everywhere, but we'll leave them for Turkey to pick up because they've got troops much closer by than we have. And then we shall send these troops here. Those troops are being shot to pieces. Get them in the sea, just go for it, otherwise they're going to die anyway. Um, right, yeah, once they all land, we'll sort something out with those. We'll do them as a team. However, let's go and patrol, and they can help. Are you going? Hello? What? Oh, I sent them. Hey. Weird. Well, let's um, take these down here. Marvellous. Absolutely marvellous. Okay. Still being built. Got a bunch of troops here, which we will send to go down to Jaka Jakarta. Lovely jubbly. And we've got a bunch there. We could do something with these. Um, um, I'll tell you what. Should we just risk it? What's the what's the harm? Leave them behind. Just go land in there. Screw it. See what happens. Mm. Nice. Okay. Let's have a look. Yep. We're fourth. Good. Still got a long way to go to actually get there, but being top four is gravy. And we've got Australia we could probably start working on. Let's get an airport here as well. Hopefully that'll be 
done so we can start storing jets and talking jets let's make as many jets as we can we can send them all in go oh, yeah we're producing we are producing get a level two going everywhere even all the places we build the boats let's get airports for everyone spending the resources hello I pushed the wrong button can't afford level two who we get a level one nope and now we're poor now never mind not gonna worry about getting any more troops because I feel like we don't really have to worry about that just yet um and get them to sail down here you know Turkey have got this front line smashed I don't think we're gonna have any problems and if we do we can always knock out some troops quite quickly um excellent and then we'll be moving on to Australia as soon as Indonesia is wrapped up like I say once these troops have disembarked oh we've got three and a bit weak actually um We'll wait for these <clears throat> we'll go day 31 part one we'll be able to send these around the island and hopefully claim most of it they'll do it together because they're a bit i mean they're good these are these are quite weak and they're a bit weak as well but we're going to be patrolling with our jets as well so we should be fine um have i got any more jets up here Those are random places Nope. <clears throat> okay, let's have a quick look at how the Allies are getting on around the world. Very well. Really, it's just kind of crazy. Um, Africa's nearly taken, and really, South America is just untouched. Is it Brazil that owns quite a chunk of it? Okay. Is it rogue states just been left? Can't. They must be busy fighting, or just not bothering. All right, well, we'll see what happens. Um, yeah, I'll be back for day 31. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you have enjoyed it, please do drop a like on the video and subscribe to the channel for more daily content. And I'll see you on the next one. The dude is out.